Okay, and final question. Um, since this is our user conference and you are such a high profile um, user or open AI is, I'm curious if you could say a little bit about how open AI uses weights and biases and if you have a favorite um, feature or part of uh, weights and biases, we'd love to know about that. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we use it for for pretty much all of our model training. So just like you know, uh, you, you know, just 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 tracking them. I think there's a lot of kind of just sharing of like you know the fact that you can easily share share uh, share kind of training runs and stuff like that. It's a super used feature. But I think one thing that you know these days I I, I do way way less of that sort of work. So one of the features I really like is is kind of the ability to kind of have reports and so on where people, so we use that uh, quite heavily. It depends a little bit on the team, but a number of teams are using that quite heavily to kind of really have clear hypothesis. Here's like the hypothesis. Uh, here, here, here is the, here are the experiments that were run to kind of validate or invalidate that hypothesis. Here's the conclusion. You have all these like mini scientific papers essentially on all of the stuff that's happening at OpenAI, which is like incredibly interesting to kind of uh, follow along with. Fantastic! That sounds very interesting. <laughs>